Hi, I'm Meg. Hi, I'm Jake. And, and we're, we're Meg and Jake's, Jake's Adventures. <laughs> Morning, guys. Welcome back to Meg and Jake's Adventures. You catch us on our way uh, to Bath. We're about two and a half hours away still. Um, yeah, just going to be driving through mine head in a minute. So we'll uh, we'll see you when we're in Bath. I say there's a uh, lots we've got planned to do there. I think we're going to go and see the Roman Bath. Simply Meg. Yeah. Um, maybe try a few bars, but we've been recommended Bath by a few people now. So uh, uh, we'll see you when we're there. And by the way, guys, from what we, we can tell so far, I mean, we've been to Somerset, Devon, and Cornwall quite a few times before. Um, but from what we can tell, the park ups in Somerset are uh, loads better than the ones in Devon and Cornwall. There seems to be way more of them. Load, like most of them we've seen in Somerset don't have no overnight parking signs, whereas in Cornwall and Devon, pretty much all of them, they don't yeah. want you to park overnight to them. Which is a shame, really, because it brings so much more tourism, wouldn't it? But, uh, like, you know, but. It is what it is, but yeah, that park up last night was gorgeous, wasn't it? And I say, yeah. around, that, that, that was like the main park up, which is on park for nine. But there was like five or six of the park ups, like right by it, that you could have stayed at as well. Yeah. Um, it was, yeah, brilliant. So, uh, definitely a thumbs up for uh, Somerset there. <laughs> see all the historical buildings and stuff um, and then probably go in the baths depends how much it's going to cost because we are quite Oops. tight <laughs> yeah so we'll um <laughs> we'll show you some historical things yeah and some bars probably <laughs> and we going to greg's <laughs> maybe if there is a greg's fun fact about me is that i've got a 50 percent greg's discount card cheers Jaden. thanks mate <laughs> So, we're at Bennett Street Circus. It's a large circus full of townhouses here in Bath. They were all made between 1754 and 1765, I think it was. They're lovely. Very pretty. You can tell it's been uh, influenced by the Romans, can't you? Definitely. Reminds me of Rome a bit with all the pillars and stuff. Yeah. Gorgeous. <laughs> so we've just come to a um, little aisle shop in Bath and we've just got some nice drinks. I've got pink guava and light cheese, triple fruity ghosts. And I've had whatever that is, which is 8.5%. Oh, 8.8. Oh dear. Not driving back, Nick. <laughs> Test to your drink. That's so sour. <laughs> <laughs> Well, so we're at um, the Royal Crescent, and I think behind us that's a Royal Victorian Park. Um, this consists of 30 townhouses, which were built between <laughs> 1767 and 1775. 75, yeah. So oh, by the way, the last was 69, not 65. I got it wrong, sorry. So, yeah, there you go. I'm feeling very joyful after my uh, eight and a half. <laughs> Uh, well, 8.8% beer. <laughs> yeah, so for dinner, we've come to the greatest food place of all time, Five Guys. Much to Meg's pleasure. I didn't want to come here. <laughs> I mean, it's got cheap bricks. But... You won't complain when you eat it though, will you?
to at the, uh, the Roman Baths, having a look around, got our audio guide, so we're uh, going to listen to all the history that we'll probably forget in about an hour. <laughs> So we've come to a Kingsmead Street bottle shop. We decided to have two flights of beer each, so uh, we'll see how we feel at us. <laughs> I've come for very strong ones again. <laughs> Level one. Ding, ding. <laughs> so uh, we've been a bit naughty for tea. Instead of having our sandwiches, we've uh, come to the one and only. We've had little mini meals. But look how small. Go for the biggest one on the menu. Look how small. That's so cute. Like <laughs> <laughs> a slider. Well, uh, enjoy. Mm. So, pub number three, I think it is. Done for our rums, which is, if you don't know, it's one of our favourites, is a rum. And I've had a caramel, what, caramel, and blah, blah, blah. And Meg's had a banana, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Very, very, very nice. Yeah, we're going to chill here with anyone. Fidel's Communist Bar. We're going to leave here in a minute, and then we're going to go up to, it's like a live music bar, so. Catch you then, won't we? Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> so we've come to this pub called The Bell and it's got one of my favourite bands playing on the playlist and they've got black country scratchings. What more could you yeah, want? And summer lining, which is one yeah. of our favourites from the local and pub. Home. Maybe live music, I'm not sure. So. Probably not, maybe. Alright, guys, so we're uh, just walking back to the, uh, the old trusty bongo now, Bella. Um, so, it's probably going to be a great time to uh, finish the video for today, I think. Yeah. Um, we've had a great time in uh, Bath today, and we obviously been in Bath most of the day, journey this morning, but uh, we've had an awesome time, haven't we? Yeah, it's just um, so much to do, so much to see. Like, it's just great, and it's, everything's beautiful as well, like all the streets, are just even like dry markets, pretty, do you know what I mean? But we said, like, you know, back where we're from, you know, in like Birmingham and stuff, you've got like maybe, you know, a couple decent bars, you know, four or five decent bars, and the rest of them are like, Pretty shitty, <laughs> but uh, you know, here yeah, everything's been uh, been brilliant, so we've really enjoyed it. Um, but yeah, so definitely recommend coming to Bath if you're anywhere near, or even if you're not, just come down your van if you've got one. 
or your car, whatever. So we've got to wake up tomorrow, we're going to wake up early, about six o'clock, and uh, make our way back home briefly, because we're going to swap over our clothes. Um, resupply. Resupply the water, and then we're off to Wrexham, so we'll probably catch you tomorrow. So uh, make sure again, you like, subscribe. Hit the bell. Hit the bell, yeah. <laughs> and all that good stuff, and we'll uh, hopefully see you on the next one. Hopefully you enjoyed. Cheers, guys.